What's up with it, y'all? Welcome to. That's how the YouTubers be. They be like, What's up with it, y'all? It's your boy. Nigga, it's E. Jones. Back with another tutorial. Today's video is a Mohawk tutorial. It is similar to a video I already posted. Curly top with a ball fade. So before you say anything, yes, I know it is similar to that one. Just a little bit more hair in the back. The steps are the same. Y'all was asking for it in the DMs. So here y'all go. If you do like the video, hit that thumbs up button. Drop a comment. And don't be no ghost watcher. Don't be coming to my channel every week talking about, oh, did he post a... Just hit the subscribe button, bruh. Show some support. Fuck, bruh. I'm running out of shit to say in these intros. So we just gonna have to cut to it. <sighs> All right, wait, wait, one more thing, one more thing. Don't skip this part. If my audio does sound fucked up, I do not have a microphone plugged into the camera. Battery died on it, and it's a special type of battery. I didn't have time to buy one, so y'all stuck with this audio. All right, all right, let's go. Yeah. All right, so like all the rest of my haircuts, we're gonna grab our wall detailer and start balding on his hair. And this part, we're actually gonna be carving out his mohawk, so it's, cut, it's gonna be like a U shape. And a tip I can give you guys, when you make that U at the back of his hair, make that U go all the way down to like as low as possible. That way when you do fade out the back of his hair, you keep that mohawk shape. If you go too high, it's just gonna look like a fade. God that you me yeah. said fuck love then you made me believe yeah I sent up my prayer you the blessing I receive you yeah. Lord don't take her from me know that you made her for me with all the shit that we go through can you bless her with the patience for me Girl, your love is contagious for me then we're gonna pick out his hair so I do spray water that way it's easier to pick out and I'm not pulling the client's hair and if my videos are starting to seem repetitive it's because i never know who's gonna watch my video they could be new so they want they might not know my steps so if you are a returning subscriber please forgive me so we're gonna grab our one and a half on our all-star 76ers and this part you don't want to go too high because you want to leave room to fade into the mohawk you don't want it to be one and a half and then just curls that would look stupid so leave your leave yourself some room to fade up into the mohawk we had them late nights, them great nights when we walked around the hood. I brag about And now we're gonna fade from that one and a half up to his mohawk. So we're gonna grab our Candace Masters two guard open. we are flick out the very top of his fade up into the curls. Clearly you understood, I know to get it. No, you trust me with your heart, you won't regret it. Now we're gonna grab our one guard all the way open and start a fade from that one and a half up to that long number two. Yeah. So give me all of you in exchange for me. Just give me I'm gonna go back to our two guard clothes to fade from that long number one up to that long number two. Yeah. You got my word, little mama. Yeah. Just give me all of you. And I did do the other side a little bit different. I already had the two guard on there, so I just opened and closed the two guard in the back and the other side, and then I went. From that one and a half up to the two guard open and closing, I went back with my one guard open. If you guys learn easier by me typing the instructions on the screen, I would do that in the next video. Actually, next tutorial, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna type the instructions out and get in case any of you guys learn easier that way. Far beyond predictable, and I hope that you killing every nigga trying to get it. We're gonna start shaping his hair and knocking down his hair that we don't want on there. And this part you don't want to go too low because you want to remember his hair is picked out and when the hair is wet, it's going to shrink back down. For you they don't deserve, baby, that's where it couldn't help but fall for you. I would give it all for you. I would take a loss for you. Another tip I'll give you guys when shaping someone's mohawk, you want to find that sweet spot between too thick and too skinny. If you Don't make it too skinny. If anything, make it too thick. Because a too skinny mohawk, you, what are we doing here, Mr. T? Alright, so we're gonna grab our fast piece to start blending out his fade. We're gonna go close and make our first guideline. If you guys don't know what open and close means, oh, close is when the lever is all the way up and it, it, that means closer. When I say open, it means longer. Constantly I stare at your photos on Instagram. I wish we could talk. We're gonna open up that lever and make another guideline right on top of that. 
Just know the future seems so bland with my heart in your hand. Just want our love back, so distant. If you guys aren't familiar with any of my videos, it's something I call trigger play. It's where you move the lever up and down, up and down, flicking out, trying to knock that fade line out between two layers. This mental portfolio and memories where I hate it. I want love, promise love, I'm in love. This ain't lust in the law. I see the pain through your arm, stroke your brush once more. You're inspired, I feel through your fire. Pathological liar. I think it's time to let the pin breathe. So on top of that, open with no guard, we're gonna go with our 116th purple guard and make a guideline right on top of that. I miss my girl and I need my lover. I lost my inspiration, my muse. Cold world is like a blizzard, nigga. She don't wanna be around and answer cause that's her decision. That should be So between that 116th and no guard all the way open, we're gonna go back to no guard all the way open and flick that line out. And I also fade I also go back down and fade out any dark spots I see. I'm real OCD with this. How you sit right in the face when your heart is hurting still. Why you staying with a woman who don't wanna prioritize? She just wanna live a life. Just take a look inside. The value of conversations don't really matter. She'd rather be with that rapper. So I got my one guard closed. And at this point, I'm not trying to make another guy line. I'm just trying to fade the hair up to the mohawk. How the love you have increased the distance. Stranger when you're stranger. So then I open that one guard and I begin to flick out into that tube that we used initially. Life is crazy, my nigga. I think I need a drink. Just hand me the jack or something. And I'm also going to be opening and closing this one guard to knock out any dark spots I see at the top of his fade up into the curls. And going back down between that 116th and that one guard closed, we're going to go back to our 116th, open and close it and knock out that line between the 1 and the 116th. All right, you wanna talk about us right now? And to knock out that very faint bottom line, we're gonna go back to our detailers using the corners of that, flicking out, and the bottom line should just come right out. You be talking about you ready, but you probably couldn't even keep up right now. Every night a different state, on the road getting paid, probably won't communicate. All right, to connect both sides of his face in the back, we're gonna go with our fast beach clothes. And with these guidelines, you wanna make it like a U shape, that way it connects better and it flows better. So open up our lever, we'll make a guideline right on top of that. Just don't be starting no arguments about things that we've been through. Cause you know I hate to see you cry. But that shit kill a nigga, no lie. I know nobody really likes goodbyes, but you know I'm gonna swing that way. Whenever my time is free, girl, you know me, I swing that way. Now we're gonna fade up into the curls first. So we're gonna grab our one guard closed and then open that and then open and close, open and close, trying to fade those hairs into the mohawk. Whenever my time is free, girl, you know me, I swing that way. Then from there, we're gonna make another guideline, our last guideline, our 116 closed. Don't judge me. I know this shit sounded real OVO. I'm only doing this for the moment though. We going up like a jet. Kicking it with Rolex in the West Coast. Oh man, right now I'm feeling blacker than ever. Who do I blame? The LAPD or this LAX weather? But I ain't gonna get too deep. Cause I know I be preaching like a reverend. I might as well be. Cause everybody tell me I'm a blessing. Now to fade up into that 116th guard, we're just gonna open and close with no guard. He been locked down since I was a shorty. That was the first time I ever seen my dad cry. Yeah. And he an OG to the grave. He ain't even shed a tear when they was letting down his brother in the grave. Yeah. My pop said, son, if you cry, make sure no one's around. Cause you'll never ever wanna let another And I seen some dark spots where that 116th was, so I went back with my 116, open and close, open and close. Trying to knock out any dark spots. Probably won't communicate as much as I want to But when it's all too much and I need a break To knock out that bottom line to connect everything You just go back with your detailers and flick out Swing that way Whenever my time is free 
yeah, you know me. All right, if you guys didn't watch my last tutorial, we're gonna do something I call prep the lineup. Is where you take a one guard with their anus masters with the grain and knock down any hairs that are standing up or curling. Whenever my time is free. And after this, I always spray alcohol. That way, it removes any dirt, grime. And it is becoming hotter outside, and, and your clients will sweat. And this the alcohol removes any sweat or any oils like that. Now look, if you don't want to get your ass beat by one of your clients, they might be bigger than you, don't push back their hairline. That's probably the worst thing you can do. Keep it natural, keep it sharp, make sure those corners are sharp, make sure the corners match up. These emotions feel so bittersweet. She can't explain just why she's into me. Cause just before this we were enemies. She had a man, but I was in between. Guess I'm a TYG, but oldest girl can they? She told me she was addicted to my melodies. And when I hit that note, it made her bend the knees, clench her toes, bend her head back. And now. Moving on to his part, it's just gonna carry on alongside his mohawk all the way down to the back of his mohawk. And what I say is, if you can visualize the part, you can do the part. Don't make the part thick. I promise you, do not make that part thick. Keep it as skinny as possible, but noticeable, if that makes sense. Big songs for women. I can take your girls. I can take your girl. Careful where you leave her, because I can take your girl. Again, I do apologize for the cord being in the way. It's either my arm or the cord, so you guys are stuck with the cord. But just flip that clipper over, hit the bottom of the line, and it's gonna bring out your line even more. Don't let your girlfriend be by me. Yeah, T to the Y to the G. Don't let your girlfriend be by me. I'm a TYG to the TYG. Don't let your girlfriend be by me, man. T to the Y to the G. Don't let your girlfriend razor for you new viewers. Just stretch the skin, keep the razor flat. Go slow, don't rush if you're not uh, comfortable with the razor. It can be dangerous. If I believe, how would you live without me? Got a few girls for the night. She don't really think it's When your client's laying down like this, it's the best time to see his hairline completely. And if you don't see that it's straight, grab some liners and make it straight. This part can be dangerous, so go slow, have a slight hand, and make it straight. All these songs for women. All these songs for women. All these songs for women. She loved the way that I sing. All these songs for women. All these songs for women. All these songs for women. And I'm very OCD with this part. Whatever clipper you use, grab those and knock out any dark spots you see. Make sure that fade is right. And to finish up any haircut that I do, I grab my shears and knock out any flyaway hairs that I see. After this, you will see me use oil sheen. That's just to give his hair any shine and make it smell good. So that's it for this video. Hit that thumbs up button, drop a comment, smash that subscribe button. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.